Major medical groups in the U.S. are now calling for mandatory COVID vaccines for health care workers. At least one local hospital is on board with that recommendation. WGN's Tanya Francisco is live at Rush University Medical Center on the west near west side. Good afternoon, Tanya. Hey there, Lord, it's in Ben. Yeah, and the number of medical mandates are growing. Just late this afternoon, the Department of Veterans Affairs announced that it will require its medical staff to be fully vaccinated. Now, when it comes to Rush, this is something that it's been mulling over for weeks now, and it comes, as you point out, several medical groups, including the American Medical Association and the American Nurses Association, call for a mandatory vaccination policy, saying it is an ethical obligation. Rush University Medical Center joins a growing number of hospitals and healthcare systems requiring all employees to get the COVID-19 vaccine. We think it's really critically important that if you're a patient coming to Rush University Medical Center, you should know that, you know, whoever you're encountering on the Rush team is vaccinated and you're protected and not at risk of contracting COVID. All staff, those who come in contact with patients, even those who don't, as well as contractors and volunteers must be fully vaccinated by October 1st. That's about 13,000 people. Right now, the hospital says more than 80% of its staff has already rolled up its sleeve and <laughs> taken the shot. It wasn't without a lot of thought um, and a lot of input from all of our staff and our patients as well uh, that we went through prior to putting out this mandate. It's a mandate that many municipalities and government agencies are taking on. California and New York City are requiring all government employees to get the coronavirus vaccine or face weekly COVID-19 testing. The longer we wait to extinguish this disease, the more likely that we will be facing another variant, another mutation. We're looking at a lot of different options. Chicago Mayor Lori Lightfoot says we're not there yet, but she's having conversations with the city's labor unions. The move comes as officials are trying to beat back a summer surge driven by the Delta variant. COVID is not going away uh, anytime soon. And really, at this point, as the CDC director has said, it's really a pandemic amongst two different communities, those that have been vaccinated and those that haven't been vaccinated. So we really you know, want our family, our community, our, our staff to be part of that vaccinated uh, community that's protected from the ill effects of COVID. Now, Dr. Casey would not say if people will be fired if they do not uh, take this uh, vaccine uh, like they're requiring. They say they're still in talks over that and there will be some reasonable exceptions. Now, he points out that Rush University points out that this mandate is like many other vaccines that they require, much like the flu. I'm live this evening on the near west side. Tanya Francisco, WGN News. Thank you, Tanya.